Hey, everybody. How are you? We're having some technical glitches tonight. I'm so sorry. Just want to make sure that we're going to be live over here on Instagram. We'll be on YouTube. We can go live and everybody's going to be all happy, happy. Okay. Hang on just a second. I'm going to close the door. Okay. I'm back. All right. So hi, sorry about that. Um, sometimes we think we're ready to go and we're not ready to go. Hi, Dottie. Um, so we've got some fun things planned for you tonight. I'm really excited. Uh, you know, all month long, the month of April is the anniversary at Just Jill, which is always exciting. And we've tried to put together some really great offers. We've brought in a lot of brand new product. Um, if you're looking at our cool lanterns, obviously these are our Lumi's lanterns, but we have an unbelievable offer on them for you and that's based on how popular they were when we launched them last month in fact the company that works with lumis came to us and said wow your little shop your shoppers are really loving our lanterns we have a closeout opportunity is that something you might be interested in offering to your customers um hello sale and i was like well what's the catch and so we'll talk about that there really is no catch there's one slight tiny design difference that I don't think if I even told you what it was, you would ever notice it in the first place or even care about it. But basically, bottom line, if you want to go find them right now over at JustJillShop.com, our single Lumis we were selling for um, $59. Now they're $44. We're doing sets of two that were $79. They're now $49. And because it's the anniversary at Just Jill, if you buy more than one Lumi's tonight, you get 10% off your Lumi's order. So not only are they sale price for these closeout deals, and by the way, when this collection of Lumi's is gone, they're gone. But if you buy more than one for your garden, it'll be an additional 10% off. Um, your entire Lumi's order. So amazing, amazing, amazing. Amanda, I have four of them. Love them. Just ordered two more. One to send to my sister on Australia. Oh my God, they're fabulous. They're so good. And there's so many things about them because you might have seen some that look similar that are like 25 bucks. But I want to tell you why our quality is so good um, because this quality is not, they're not paper. They're not cardboard. They, these are made of unbelievable materials. Kylie, do I need to send you a new link? I think I do. I think I do. Hang on just a second. I had to do a whole new stream. Okay. I'm going to send Kylie something. We're going to do a little Kylie cam with Kylie because she's going to actually go outside. Stand by as I'm doing this for her. Um, she's going to go outside and um, there you go. Um, show you the Lumis outside in our backyard because they're so pretty. I'm going to tilt this down just a little bit. All right. So before I go Lumi's crazy, hi, everybody. How's everybody doing? Nice to see you. Happy April. Um, the last couple of days have been beautiful here in Pennsylvania. Um, Caring Cardinals. Lanterns will be perfect for my memorial garden. Oh, I love that. Um, last couple of days have been beautiful in Pennsylvania. We've been at baseball games the last couple of days. Trevor's high school team is like nine and one. They're doing awesome. Um, he's having a, you know, a nice season, um, had, was one for two today with an RBI. So we love that. Um, but everybody's just playing fantastic. There's some, you know, kids on his team that are, you know, you know, going to division one schools. Others are, you know, going to go to these like high profile, like, um, junior college programs, hoping to transfer into the bigger schools. So they have a really good team. So it's really fun to go watch. So we've been doing that the last couple of days. Um, just kind of scooting around doing life things. Like sometimes you have to just make time for the life stuff. So, you know, I had a doctor's appointment yesterday. I went and got blood work for an upcoming physical. Like, do you even care about any of this? But hey, like I have to get it done too. So um, got my mammogram scheduled. Make sure you've scheduled your mammogram. If you've forgotten, make sure you get on that. Um, and what else did we do? I saw my mom um, yesterday. She went to the game with us. So that was nice. And um, just, you know, kind of enjoying spring been getting ready to plant some new things outdoors. I'm partnering with Bushel and Berry, Bloomables, and Knockout Roses again this year. So um, we put some blogs up over the weekend and yesterday, kind of just a little sneak peek into what my garden looked like last year and the success that I had. Can I tell you, I wish it wasn't dark outside. I would take you out to my blackberry and blueberry bushes. All right, I've never grown berries ever in my life, ever. Okay, I've grown strawberries. 
but I've never done anything else because I because for a long time I didn't have the time um, or the space. Um, or frankly, the desire, because there's a lot of other things going on, raising my family and working and doing these things. So last year when I partnered with Bushel and Berry, they sent me some plants and said, you know, we believe in them, give them a try. I grew them in containers on my deck, didn't have to dig holes in the ground. They're just in whiskey barrels. Those things are, they, uh, there are so many buds on these plants. And you know what happens to buds? Buds turn into blooms and blooms turn into berries. Like I am gonna have legit blueberry, blackberry bushel crops this year. So um, I'm really excited about that. I am gonna grow some bushel and berry strawberries this year. We're gonna do some more raspberries this year. And then we're gonna plant, there's a new variety of knockout roses. It's a petite knockout. So um, I'm gonna give you my experience with that. We, there's a new, they have a um, variety of hydrangea that kind of rivals the limelight hydrangea, but unlike limelights that when they get wet from rain, the water just drenches those blooms and they all kind of droop over. Um, this particular variety um, stays more upright, which is awesome. So um, some really great gardening things coming up um, this year um, as, I, as I work with Star Roses and, and their wonderful assortment of plants. And of course, we carry also a lot of varieties that are very different, um, kind of the specialty varieties from my friends at Roberta's. We carry those over at Just Jill Shop. So, you know, there's always stuff you can find. Speaking of gardening, we did um, add in a couple of cute garden sets might be nice for mom for mother's day or a birthday gift some cute um it's like an apron glove and kneeling um pad set one is in denim oh my gosh the cutest bucket a denim gardening um apron and um i'm trying to think and a kneeling pad that's a bucket a pad and the denim um apron and then we did one with sort of flowers and bumblebees lightweight so check those out over at just jill shop as well those are from eshert designs um okay so um i was just looking at lisa's comment i ordered the new flower shaped trinket dish any idea when that will be shipped it's for a mother's day gift lisa um i will make sure and if megan or um Kylie can hear this. Can you send Lisa's name to Bernadette and just have her check real quick? Because those probably should be going out because um, we did get the inventory in. So you will get them and Bernadette can look and see when those might be sent to you. Um, and let me just show you those. Since you brought those up, Lisa, I'm going to talk about the lanterns in just a second, everybody. Um, we have more colors and more shapes than we did when we launched. And again, this is a special offer. So um, I'll talk about those in just a second, but we have a couple other new things that I want to get to that are sort of just like quick hits, and then I'll spend more time talking about Lumi's and what makes them so different. So those flower dishes you were talking about, Lisa, are these three. So these are brand new. You haven't seen these yet. They've been on the site, but we haven't talked about them. First of all, they're cast iron. So these are heavy. These are not flimsy, light as air. Um, they're cast. They're gorgeous. So look how they've done, there's three colors. There's the ivory, the solid bronze, and the kind of verdigris with gold, all right? And um, they're so, they feel so good. But they, you can see the size of them. There it is in my hand. I love how the petals are curved up. And then there you can see close up, all of the detail. Look at the dimension there. Look at the way there's like this sort of flowing sculpt, almost like a windblown petal look um, to those dishes. So what would you use something like this for? Well, um, you could use it obviously, like where you come in and put your keys. This could be a great little, like I would use it for my jewelry, um, you know, where I would put my earrings and maybe a necklace, my watch, the things that I wear all the time. It's so pretty as just a little, you know, object of art on um, a stack of books that you might have on a tray. Oh, we have a tray set coming up. You asked, I found one, great price too. Um, you can use this as just, you know, if you have some of those little like L stands, if you wanted to sort of mount it up this way and nestle it into a bookcase, you could do that. Um, just, you could use this as a soap dish. Obviously there's nowhere to drain, but for one of our soap rocks, if you wanted to use this as a little soap dish, you could certainly do that too. Um, we just thought they were pretty. We thought, you know, with Mother's Day coming up 
or you're just needing maybe bridesmaids gifts, maybe your daughter or granddaughter's getting married, she needs some ideas like how pretty would this be? This is something that if you got it when you were a bridesmaid in your 20s, you would still have it out on your dresser or a counter or a coffee table or next to your kitchen sink when you were in your 50s. Like you would have it forever. So um, great colors on this one. Again, the verdigris. This is the solid bronze. So it doesn't have any of the gold. But think of how pretty that would be. Maybe this is on a little kitchen island where you have this um, oil rub bronze detail on your light fixtures, or maybe it's on your handles for your cabinets. Maybe you did an oil rub bronze look in your family room with some of your lamps. This can kind of tie it together. It's one of those little touches that sort of would make your space feel very designed because you had just this little coordinated piece with some of your bigger fixtures. And then if you do more of a farmhouse look and you're doing a lot of those whites, creams, distressed, whitewashed, those kinds of things that that one there is the like the soft white or ivory. And then you can see it has the gold um, that kind of highlights the petals and the detail. All right, so those are our brand new flower trays. Love those. Um, and you can hear too, right? They're heavy. They have a really, you're going to get this home and be like, she wasn't kidding. Not heavy, like uncomfortable, you can't lift it. But just like, wow, that feels really nice. That's going to be a pretty impressive gift when I give it to somebody. So check those out, okay? Um, all right, let's talk about something that um, this is really a Bernadette pick, I have to say. So ever since we started Just Jill Shop, um, Bernadette loves birds, first of all. But she has been obsessed with finding a studio or an artist to do some blown glass pieces. And we really wanted to find um, a studio in the United States. We wanted it made in the USA. And so we did. Um, and we found Epiphany Studios in Pontiac, Michigan. This is a woman owned business, started over 30 years ago. And she does beautiful, and her team do beautiful blown glass pieces. She actually, April Wagner, I say she, April Wagner is the founder. April does incredible sculptures, like for commercial businesses. Like think of like sort of um, maybe on a smaller scale, but sort of Dale Chihuly, like blown glass, which I'm obsessed with. I love blown glass too. But when we met April, she did smaller pieces too. And we thought, you know, for gift giving, and for those of you who I think are a little bit like me, and love to see pretty things that might remind you of something or just make you smile, these might be that perfect find for you at Just Jill. And so, drum roll, here are our new pieces that we're introducing to you from Epiphany Studios. And remember, you can find all of these items at JustJillShop.com. Shipping and handling is included with all of your orders. Um, so the price that you see on the item is the price that you will pay um, with the addition of shipping and handling if it applies for your state. But the price is the price, your shipping and handling is included. Okay, so let's start with the birds. All right, so these are blown glass birds. And you have a choice, I'm gonna come up close, of this beautiful white dove, which has this metallic kind of goldish, almost like a, there's gold and a little bit of a bronze color in there. But look at the detail on this. Like I, I was watching a video of how these pieces are made, you know, and it starts with a blob of this hot molten glass. And then the artists are using these tools and pinching and clamping and, you know, shaping this. Um, there's texture on the wing here. This is this beautiful dove. I think it's very peaceful. I love how the beak is left clear, but then you can see that the glass is rolled in this beautiful white. It has these beautiful um, accents. Each one is gonna be slightly different. Um, and then each piece will have the stamp on the bottom. Can you guys see that? It's a heart. And then etched into the glass, it says Epiphany 2024. So there is our dove. And then look at this sweet bluebird. Like, tell me that is not going to make you happy, either sitting on a windowsill, sitting on your desk, sitting where you have your morning coffee, um, a, a sweet little bluebird um, that's come to visit you. If your house is decorated in blue and white, you're going to love this too. It's all solid, 
really beautiful, made in the USA, again, made in Pontiac, Michigan. It's the largest glass blowing factory or studio in Michigan. Um, and we're thrilled to be able to offer these Epiphany Studio pieces. So there are our birds. Jeanette said, oh my goodness, Jill, I love birds. This is just so pretty. They're really special. They're really special. All right, so gifts for Mother's Day, um, you know, housewarming gifts, maybe two white doves as a wedding gift for somebody, very special and unique. All right, so there's the birds. Then we also know you all love hearts. And so these hearts, by the way, those birds can be used as like paperweights and things like that too. Look at these hearts. Okay, the heart, the video on this is unbelievable. Um, and how they make this and how they put these, you know, the crushed glass and other um, colors on the inside. And this comes in three different colors and it will come with a stand. So if you want to set it up, you know, to display it, you can. If you want to sit it flat as a paperweight, you can. What a wonderful way to say, I love you. Another great wedding gift. This comes in three different colors. So we have this beautiful kind of pink, red, and white. There's the back that you can see. There's the little hallmark and it'll say epiphany and the year. So we have one that's done in the pinks and the reds for you. We have one that's done in the blues, kind of oceany. Is, you know, that's what I like. So look how pretty that is. Isn't that gorgeous with the cobalt and then almost like a milky aquamarine going through there. Isn't that fantastic? Love it. I love, love it when we find these things for you. And then this has this gorgeous teal color and then this kind of like a creamy taupe running through it. What I like about this one is you can really see the translucency, um, almost like a, um, like a Pariba tourmaline. And then you have that really pretty um, taupe color that goes along with it too. All right, so those are our heart items. And then, I know you all know how much I love our dogs. And because of that, we have offered a lot of sort of dog items if there have been pet things. But I know that there are a lot of cat lovers out there too. And so this one is for you. So this is kind of this cool, um, organic, modern, how about I just do this? Oh, that's so much better, then I don't have to dip over. Um, it looks like a swirled glass. But if you look close, it's actually a little kitty, like wrapped around, like all snuggled up in a ball. And she, April did this one color called Calico. So it's the cream and the black and the butterscotch. And again, weighty, you can use this as a little paperweight if you want to. Look at the little ears. So cute. It's like very like modern contemporary, but like kind of like if you know, you know right? Like, um, and then we have one here in this kind of ginger color. Look at that. Doesn't that just look like um, like that sort of orange colored cat? Sorry if I don't know all of the actual breeds, um, but I, I love the little e What? A ginger. I did say ginger. Okay, well, good. I got that one right. Little ears, and then look at the colors. And then finally, look at the black cat. But what's cool about the black cat is there's this wonderful kind of sparkly color. It's sort of um, like a warm bronzy color on the inside. So that's the one that we have for you there. And then we have other options for you. If you go look at the site, you'll find in some of these different things I'm showing you that we have more colors than we're showing you here. So you can go find those over at justjillshop.com. But just so you have an idea of like what they look like, there's like the cat lovers are going to love this. I kind of love this one too, because, you know, I went to the University of Missouri, Kylie did too, and our mascot is a tiger. And I sort of see tiger stripes in this one a little bit. I don't know, kind of fun. All right, so there's that. And then last but not least, in our Epiphany Studios collection, we have these beautiful blown glass, kind of more traditional, I think it's pretty, oh, I think they're so pretty more traditional type of paperweights or spheres, orbs, however you wanna call them. And again, so pretty, sitting in your bookcase with a picture next to it, maybe one of our candles, putting this on a coffee table, on a tray with a stack of books, um, maybe a little vase of flowers, and then this beautiful orb. 
um, different colors to choose from. I'm just gonna show you a couple here and you can go online to see the others. But they actually are able to swirl this glass within the glass. And it's just, it's weighty, um, it feels good, and it's pretty. So there's one that's done in the pinks and the reds. Here's one done in the blues. Like you can see how there's like a handle almost going through there with the, the bubble on the inside, which is pretty cool. And then here's one that's done with purple, almost like an indigo. I mean, you can definitely see that it's purple, but it's sort of that darker purple, almost blue color um, going all the way around. Pretty neat, right? And then again, all of those have the hallmark on the inside. Um, Sandy said, I got an orb and orange. Can't wait. Oh, Sandy, I'm so excited for you. Yay. Um, so Epiphany Studios, everybody. Love that. We're so excited. Again, from Pontiac, Michigan, woman-owned business, April Wagner started this over 30 years ago. Um, and we're thrilled to be able to carry her items now. And just chill. You know, it's one of the things that we really like to do for you here. Yes, we carry some brands that are nationally recognized brands. We're very lucky to have those relationships. But we love it when we can shine a spotlight on businesses and products and artists and people that you may not ever know about. I mean, let's face it. If you live in Seattle, Washington, or you live down in Boca in Florida, how would you ever know about a glass blowing studio in Pontiac, Michigan? How would you ever know about this wonderful family-run pepper jam business called Southern Root Sisters in Oklahoma. Um, you know, those are the things that we love to do here at Just Jill is, is really bring you a truly curated collection of things that we find, of things that our team loves. Um, we test them, we look at them, we feel them. We work with good people. You know, we, our, our vendors are nice. Um, they're good people and I hope you feel that energy when you get the products home from us um, after you've done some shopping with us. So, um, all right, let me talk about a couple other new things. So a lot of you have asked, because you'll see a lot of the photography we do for different things on social media, and you've asked me, could you bring in some trays? And it, it was always a little bit of a sticky thing for me simply because, um, you know, trays are expensive. And I often felt like, can I really compete with what you might be able to find at Home Goods? Frankly, that's where I go. When I go to find props for some of our pictures, I run down to Home Goods to see what I can find. But one of our partners was having a, um, like a special for their retailers. And I was able to find a, and you don't always find good things there. Like sometimes they might have a lot of great things that they're offering for this limited amount of time. And I look and I'm like, there's nothing I want here. But this time, I was like, oh, they have trays. Oh, wait, the price is what? For both of them? Okay, let's try it. Our customers have been asking for some styling trays. So this is a set of two trays. You get both of them for $59. Remember, that includes your shipping and handling. I love, these are not trays that are designed to hold heavy things for serving. These are decorative trays. This is what you might put um, you know, your um, flameless candles on. This is what you might put one of those flower dishes that we just showed you. One of the new glass pieces if you want to. If you have a kitchen island and you wanna use a tray, if you have an entry table and you wanna use a tray, you'll get two of these. One's a little bit smaller, one's a little bit larger, but do you see here? We have that cane look. Isn't that cool? I loved it. Um, I just thought it was different and fresh. The outline of the trays is all done in wood, and I'm gonna hold it up here so you can see. And it's a whitewashed look with bead on top, on bottom, and then a woven look on the inside. So you have this sturdy wood, whitewashed, whitewashed textured look on the out, outer, and then on the inside, you have this wonderful kind of look of the cane. So two of them, which I love, they'll come nestled just like this. If you wanted to give one as a gift, you know, maybe your daughter has one and you keep one, that's great too. Um, you know, use these in your powder room. Maybe, you know, you put this down, the smaller one. Um, and again, the bottom flexes just a little bit, but if it's sitting on top of a hard surface, it's gonna be fine. But maybe this is where you put, you know, that jar of cotton balls. Maybe this is where you put um, that pretty, um, 
I don't know, like jar of bath salts that you might have. Maybe this is where you put one of your soap rock dishes. Um, you know, you, you can use it for so many different things. And I love trays. I especially love them during the holidays. So all I can say is this was sort of a one-time only buy um, at this price where we could do two of them for 59 And I brought it in because I want you to start thinking about, so how might I use this come holiday? Like how pretty would this be if you filled it up with some like fake white, sort of the cottony snow and did your figurines or you have some of the illuminated houses or you do your nutcracker display. You could fill this with a sleigh and then surround it with greeneries and berries. Like you could do so many pretty things with these. So you get both of them. I hope you love them. I thought they were great. I, I just love the texture. I love the sort of um, woven cane detail on the inside. I thought these could look nice in a beach home, so they could be coastal. I think they could look great in your home in Florida. I think these can look good with farmhouse. I think these can look good traditional. I mean, I just think once you have them, you'll be able to find places to use them everywhere. So that's our new tray set. And then, but wait, there's more. We're now gonna do some throws. So listen, this was another hard kind of conversation for me to have when Bernadette and I were talking about this. Hi, everybody, by the way, that's all jumping in. I'm so glad that you're all here. Um, hi, Donna. Thanks for being here. Um, so throws. All right. So here's the deal. Um, I, I'm, I am not going to be able to do the fuzzy, furry throws like a Berkshire blanket does. I, I'm not going to be able to do the fluffy throws. Because QVC can buy 100,000 of them, and that's why they can sell them to you for 27 bucks. All right, that's just not happening here. Um, at least not yet. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll be like Oprah and have a Just Jill network. I don't know. But for the meantime, not really in the plan. Um, but I still love a good throw. I love to use throws for decorating. They add texture to a room. Of course, there's practical purposes. So again, when we were in Atlanta at the beginning of the year, we went into one of our vendor showrooms and we went over into their home decor area. It's the same vendor who we do the trays with. Um, he said, have you seen our throw assortment? They're really good value. They feel nice. Is that something your customers would like? And Bernadette and I both touched them and felt them and we were like, oh, so maybe we're onto something here. So these are our throws. They are going to be throws that are 100% cotton. We have three different choices for you. Um, they are a woven throw and they have the fringe around the bottom. They're 50 by 60 inches. They are a nice weight. They're not flimsy see-through, but they're not heavy and stiff either. Can you see that? Like they have a nice movement to them. So we did one in this kind of waffle weave that I really like. And it's done in just this super easy, natural khaki. Um, when you get these at home, I would definitely wash them. By the way, as a gift presentation, they come rolled up and they're tied up with a bow. Pictures over at JustJillShop.com when you look for these. So you'll see how they come. So it's a really nice presentation if you want to give it as a gift. But I would wash them the first time um, and then wash them on cool water. Um, put them in the dryer, no heat. Do, they're 100% cotton, everybody. You throw these in the dryer with high heat, they're going to shrink just like a t-shirt would. So put them in your dryer, tumble dry on low to no heat, let it finish drying sort of draped over your, um, the, you know, the back of your dryer. Um, and then you are going to have this wonderful throw that's the perfect weight when the air conditioning gets a little chilly when you're wanting to create a pretty entryway with that long console table and a basket and you want to throw coming out of it. I love that it has the fringe on the ends. This one again is our solid and it's kind of that natural khaki. You knew I had to do one with blue because with the whole coastal theme, plus you know I'm just obsessed with navy blue and that is our signature Just Jill color. So here's this one that has these wider stripes at the bottom that you love that. What is it about that look of those sort of mattress ticking stripes that just drives me it crazy in a good way? I just love, love, love it. And then here on the top, can you see? It's all done with the navy and that khaki color. And you can see, like, not scratchy, really nice. These are great price points. They're $39. That includes your shipping and handling. So good gift, 50 by 60. 
So I'm just gonna hold it up so you can see. Like, nice size, right? This is, if I hold it all the way up, okay, the fringe is touching the floor right now. So like, really nice size, covers me up. Doesn't that look good? For somebody who just got a beach house, I might actually send this to my best friend, Emily. They bought a house down in, um, in the, out at the Cape. Um, and I know she's been like kind of remodeling things, but nothing a nice gift for somebody who has a beach house. Love that. Or, you know, dreams of owning a beach house. Love it. And then finally, we did this one, which is still done in your neutrals, but I love this herringbone. That's another thing I'm a sucker for in design. Like I love that pattern in a tile. I love that in a texture. I love it in fabrications. So this one is done in a khaki and white stripe, or really a natural, khaki and natural stripe, but the stripes have that kind of herringbone design to them. So again, another really great look. So check these out. We were excited to bring these in. Um, and if there's a nice response to these, I think this might be a, a really fun item that we look to bring in for you for fall, for gift giving. Um, they're, they're really nicely done. I'm, I've been really impressed with this company. So, and again, for washing instructions, when you get it at home, it's gonna come rolled up with a bow, pictures of what it looks like when it arrives over at justjillshop.com. So I think you'll be happy with the presentation. That's a big thing for me too. Um, and then make sure before you use it, put it in your washing machine, cool water, um, and then put it in your dryer, low to no heat. Um, let that, you know, get most of the moisture out, spread it out, let it finish drying, and you're good to go. You don't want to put this in a hot dryer. It's 100% cotton, but that 100% cotton is what makes it soft and what also makes it breathable. So um, great throws. I hope you like them. Um, and those are brand new. Okay. One other thing. So a couple things that are like we're at the halfway point right in the month of April. So just want to let you know about a couple of offers. I don't want you to forget about because it's easy at the beginning of January or the beginning of April to say, oh, she's got those deals going all month long. I'll go back. Well, we're halfway through. And if you haven't come back, I don't want you to miss out. So almost all of our power beads bracelets um, are on sale. These are normally $49 and we sell them at $49 all day long and on Sunday. For the month of April, Jen agreed to put them all on sale for $39. So this is when you want to do your early holiday shopping. This is when you want to do gift shopping for mom, graduations for those daughters, granddaughters, goddaughters, sisters, um, family members. Um, pick up all those different motifs that we have. If you like flowers, if you like the beach, if you like, um, you know, you want religious symbols of faith, if you just want generic love, if you love birds, like we have so many different designs in the charms for you to choose from and so many different gemstones. The only bracelets that are not on sale as you look through the site are those bracelets where we donate a portion of the proceeds. So um, if we mark those down, then we've really lost the kind of buffer that we use to be able to donate. So um, our pancreatic cancer um, bracelet, our breast cancer awareness, our autism bracelet, um, our save the children bracelet, um, all of those um, still remain at the same $49 price point, but all other power beads by gem bracelets, including her status pieces, the ones that have the bigger, like elongated beads, all of those are now marked down to $39. That goes away at the end of the month. If you've not tried, or if you have tried our home fragrance, like here's where you all can help me out for a second. How many of you have tried some of our new home fragrances? Sunny Coastal Cottage, Gardenia Tuberose, Morning Dew, um, Midnight Garden, Vanilla Orchid, Sea Salt and Orchid. If you've tried any of our new home fragrances, would you tell me about them over in the comments real quick? Because I'd love to know what you think. Um, with the purchase of any of our home fragrance duos, so that's two candles, two room sprays, or our candle room spray duo, you will get a bonus two ounce room spray. That's 400 spritzes of home fragrance um, as a bonus from Candlemaker Ed. Kimberly said, I love gardenia. Awesome. I'm so glad you tried that. Um, yeah, let me know what fragrances you've tried because I, I, I want to know your thoughts on the new scents. I felt like this class of new fragrances that we brought in for spring might have been like our, our best collection in a long time. Kind of hard to top our home fragrance and cozy winter cabin, Christmas tree, pumpkin spice. Those were the originals. And we've brought in a lot of new ones, you know, each season. Lemon pound cake has probably been the most popular, along with the new with grace. 
Um, if you're a philosophy fan um, and you love Amazing Grace, I think you would love our With Grace. Um, it's, it, it has a lot of the same um, nuances and notes to them. Um, Sandy, you tried Sunny Coastal Cottage and Tuberose. Awesome. I'm glad you love that. Sunny Coastal Cottage was really our answer to the popularity of our cozy winter cabin. So um, all of those feelings and sort of like imagery from Cozy Winter ha Cabin, we wanted to put that into a, a sunny coastal cottage for you. So um, got the dough bowl candle with the sea salt and orchid, love it. I'm so glad, Rebecca. Um, yeah, so try our home fragrances. It doesn't have to be the new ones. If you have favorites that you've tried before, any of our home fragrance duos now come with a bonus two ounce room spray. It will be candle maker Ed's choice on what he puts in the box. Um, but they're all good choices. I've smelled them all. And we even did, because you all were loving that idea of the mini room sprays so much, we did a sampler of four two ounce sprays. So check those out as well. Um, that'll give you a little sampling that gives you home with grace, lavender, and I think lemon pound cake um, are in that four um, piece set. So um, check those out when you have a second. All right, should we talk about Lumi's? You guys ready to talk about these unbelievable lanterns? So here's the cool thing about Lumi's. And give me one second. I'm just going to stay here with you, but I'm going to grab one that I can hold up and talk about. And then I'll show you how to put it together. And we're going to even use the Kylie can and go outside and show you too. So here's what's so cool about a Lumi's lantern, everybody. Um, these are actually made of Tyvek, okay? This is where Lumi's is different. The other ones that you see, other places you might shop on television or where else, um, if it doesn't say Lumi's, they've copied what Lumi's has done, and they've probably used a cardboard or paper material that they've painted and tried to pass it off as, as good. It might look pretty. It's not going to hold up. The Tyvek story is what makes Lumi's so special. Tyvek is this material that's used in building your home. It's used to protect your home, the framing uh, of your home from wind and water and disintegration. So that's what this is. It's going to be UV protected. It's going to be water and wind resistant. You can see, again, like I'm just playing around with it, just to show you, um, you know, that there is this kind of cool, make sure I didn't pull that out. Um, there's this kind of cool, um, just, um, I don't know, what's like spring almost to it. It's completely perforated. Each one is perforated and inside has two AA batteries, they're included, that will illuminate and glow. And I'm going to bring my lights down here because the beauty of these is the glow. Here's the deal. So we started offering these last month and they blew out. You all went crazy for them. You were so excited. The Lumi's company came to me and said, all right, well, clearly your audience loves our product. And we have an opportunity for a closeout on a group of our lanterns. Would you like to be the one to offer those first at a reduced price to your customers? Um, yes, but what's the catch? I said to the Lumi's people. And they said, the only difference with the Lumis that you offered in March and the Lumis that we're offering right now is the color here. So if you bought one of our Lumis lanterns, and if you did, I'd love to hear your stories. There've been a few reviews on them. They're all five stars. If you bought our Lumis in March, your top of the lantern was a dyed to match the color of the lantern, okay? That grouping was the newest version of Lumi's. This was the original version of Lumi's that's battery operated. And the only difference is it has a black top. Because we're offering these with the black top, instead of them being $59 for a single, we can offer them for $44. So $15 savings. Instead of offering them for $79 for a set of two, we're offering them for $30 less, $49. And as our thank you for supporting Just Jill for the last three years, if you buy more than one Lumi's Lantern that are already sale priced, you'll get 10% off your entire Lumi's order. So 
run, don't walk <laughs> to get the Lumis. There are different shapes and different colors and different patterns for each item. So you'll really need to go check out justjillshop.com, type in Lumis, L-U-M-I-Z, and you will see the entire assortment. A couple key things. I'm going to show you how to put it together, but I also want you to know it comes with a remote control. Okay. So the remote control will turn them off. That's what they look like when they're off. All right. I love this light green one in the shape. I think it's so pretty. There's your on. You have a one hour, two hour, three hour, or four hour timer. I can make them brighter. I can make them dimmer. So you have the dimming capabilities here as well. Um, so it's the same lantern. The only difference is the top here is black, which by the way, it's hanging up in a tree. It's hanging up from an S hook. You're never going to see it. And because they're closing out this original version, they've now moved to the dyed to match. We were able to get an unbelievable value for you. Okay. So I'm going to dim some lights. If you hang the lantern inside in a corner, the reflection on the wall is so beautiful. I know, Amanda, right? Hopefully we can show that. Okay, so let me do this. Let me show you how to put it together real quickly. And then we'll do some ooh and ah time. <laughs> okay, so here's, I'm going to do two things. I'm moving around a lot, I know. Okay, so here I just want to show you. Here's the box. Okay, they're going to come to you in a flat box like this. All right? You're going to pull it out. And there's going to be this metal piece that will be separate. Okay? You're going to take, see these little J's? Like, just chill. You're going to take those little pieces and you're going to hook them on the inside of the lantern. Then you're going to pull the lantern up, just like that. Do you see what I just did? Whoop. Okay. And now it's almost like it's like little cat ears. Those little cat ears are going to go underneath. Let me see if I can do it this here. On one side and on the other. Okay. And that, see that? And that is what's going to help hold the shape. Let me just push this through here. All right, so that is your lantern. Easy enough to do. The bulb shape goes on the top and then the long piece, let me grab that for you. Got stuff in there, there it is. The long piece here, again, is what is your support structure. See it? One, two. That's what's supporting the lantern on the inside. And then you have the this piece on the outside. All right? Okay, so there's that. You know why that is not cooperating with me? I'm gonna play with that for a second. We tried to set it up ahead of time so I could just pull it quickly. And now for some reason, oh, that's the problem. All right, hang on. I'm gonna get this right for you. <laughs> so you can see what's going on. You know what happened, Kylie? It got caught in a little thing here. Nothing. Oh, it slid. Yeah, it slid. Okay, so now it's upright. Upright. Pull it up. One, two. There you go. Okay. I was trying to figure out, like, why wasn't it going right? So that's all you have to do. That's your assembly, all right? The bulb shape is on top. This is the top of the lantern. The light is on the inside. See it there? And the long piece is what supports it. And again, this is not paper. This is Tyvek. This is a construction material. It is tear resistant, wind resistant, water resistant, UV protected. And then I'm going to turn the lights off now and we're going to play. Okay. So, and we'll go out to Kylie in just a second. Okay. So I'm going to just turn that off. I'm gonna turn another light off. Okay, let's do it. Let's just see what happens here. Ready? Woo! Y'all think? Oh my gosh, isn't it? They, aren't they so good? All right, so there's so many different shapes. I'm still here. Beautiful shapes. Look at the perforation. 
Look at the glow that you get from these. Aren't they pretty? So where are you going to put these? You're going to hang these from S hooks in your trees. You're going to put these on the stakes along your walkway. If you've done cafe lights up underneath your deck, put in some teacup hooks and then hang them from the teacup hooks. I mean, these are absolutely beautiful to look at. I love the patterns. Um, these elongated ones are so pretty. I mean, that looks like a traditional lantern. This looks like those lanterns that they let go up in the sky, right? Remember the movie Tangled? And they would let the lanterns up? That's what it reminds me of. Um, so there you can kind of see different shapes, different colors. And then maybe we can go outside and um, I can, I think I can take the Kylie cam. So hopefully Kylie, are you ready? Okay, so we're gonna go to the Kylie cam. All right, everybody, here she is. And that's outside in my backyard right now. Look how those are gonna glow when you're sitting outside by your fire pit, when you're enjoying, you know, late night and the grandkids are splashing in the pool. Um, I love that round one. That color is called Petrol and it's kind of a bluish gray. It's so pretty, I love it. Um, and the beauty is like, yes, these are magic, magic, magic at nighttime, right? Um, there's one of the bulbs, those bulbs come in a set of two. Um, and that's the same shape like the green one I have by me. I'm gonna come back over into me here. Um, yeah, I mean, this is the magic, right? These are so beautiful when they're illuminated because the amount of light that comes through the pattern, the fact that these will just glow and create that patterned look against a wall, um, against the ground, the tree um, trunk, you know, whatever it might be is magical. But I don't wanna discount the fact that during the daytime when these aren't on, because they're done in colors, you know, there's pinks, there's greens, there's golds, there's taupes, there's um, these um, darker greens, there's like these bronzy colors. Those also look fantastic um, by daytime. So I'm gonna turn one of my lights back on, everybody. Um, here we go. All right, gonna turn the lights back on. Hi, we're back. So let me just do this real quickly. I'm just gonna turn these off because I do also want you to see how pretty they are. Um, it comes with a remote, Irene, like so easy, right? You have your remote, turn them on. It went on for one hour, two hour, three hour, four hour, you decide. But look how pretty this is gonna be hanging out in your backyard. Like maybe you have some beautiful, you know, pink and white roses and you can hang a beautiful pink lantern so that by the day you have this pretty hint of pink to look at and at night you have the glow. And again, it's as easy as that to turn on that glow. Isn't that pretty? I mean, they're just gorgeous. Then for the colors, this is our pretty, you see that pretty soft gold? I love that. This is the light green. I love this light green. I think that's so pretty. It's like a sage color. Some of the ones that we did in a set of two, so you could do a set of two small bulb shapes, and those are $49. When we did a set of two before everybody, they were $79, so $30 savings. And if you buy more than one set, you save 10% off of that. So you would get two of the bulb shape in this color, and I think there's three colors available in that. And then we have a set of two rounds that are done in the green. The other one's over here. Can you see that? So you would get, I'll turn it on. You get those two rounds. So they're a little bit smaller, but you could have two of them. I think, frankly, like this is just how I would go. I think the fun of the Lumis is having a whole bunch of different shapes and colors. I mean, if you want to, watch when you walk, Kylie, with the light. Um, if you want to keep it in a color family, great. But I just think the different shapes, every shape and color has its own unique pattern and seeing that outside and glowing. And listen, 
if you have a way to hang these up in your house, like maybe there are some areas that you have some fun hooks because you have like pretty beams, you know, going across and you wanted to hang some of these, you know, this is my sunroom where we are right now. And believe me, I've had these visions of like, okay, I'm going to do some fishing line and I'm going to hang these lanterns all in here. So at nighttime, I can turn them on. We have friends over if we're having a party and people are going in and out of the sunroom. Like how magical would that be to have these lanterns hanging all throughout? So um, we love them. Those of you who bought them, the originals, when we first debuted this back in March, know ah, how um, beautiful they are in person. Um, again, I know you might think, gosh, those are a little bit expensive, but I want to make sure you really compare apples to apples here because I was watching a place where I used to work and they had something that looked like it, and it was $25. And then I read what it was made out of, and it's made out of pretty much paper that's been painted. That is not gonna last in the wind, that is not gonna last in the rain, that is not gonna be UV protectant, that is not the original. They did a knockoff of Lumi's. And um, this is one of the reasons why I wanted to do this. This is why I started Just Jill Shop. I wanted to bring you the best quality. I didn't want to bring you the knockoffs, the cheap version, just so you could have it at a super discount price. What's the point if it doesn't last? These are made of a material that are designed to last for you know, many, many seasons. Um, you know, obviously if there's a crazy windstorm, um, it's not that they won't hold up, but you don't want them to blow away, right? So that might be the only thing where you might want to bring them inside, but get them at home, put them together, hang them around your home, shepherd's hooks, trees, whatever you want to do, and enjoy the beauty of Lumi's this summer. Let's turn the lights off again one more time. Um, which one is the largest one? Oh, let me show you real quickly. I'm going to turn these on for you. So the largest ones are probably this one. Give me the green one, Kylie. These, this one is the largest. I think we call this, we call this an oval. So it's probably the biggest one and it comes in a choice of three colors um, and each pattern slightly different. This green has the paisley, which is really pretty. Um, there's a taupe and then like a light gold, I think Kylie was there. This is the gold and Kylie had the taupe outside. So that's kind of the biggest one, like the chubbiest one, I would say. Um, and then for length, how about one of the long ones, Kylie? Why don't you hand me, hand me that one? This is called long oval. Yeah, this is the long oval. So it may not be as full, but it's nice and obviously it's nice and long, right? So that's going to be nice to hang in the trees too, a little bit narrower, um, but and and really a nice presence. And then how about that other round one, Kylie? I have one here too. I like this size a lot, friends. This is our, um, this is the regular taupe color. This is the gold. You can see different patterns, right? I really like this size. Like this might be nice to do one of these and then do the set of the two small. You could do that. You could do the two bulbs and then maybe then do this one. So remember when we debuted these singles were $59, duos were $79. The only difference between those and this one is that ours this one has the black on top instead of it being dyed to match the lantern color. Um, and I didn't think that was that big of a deal and it got you all a great price. So now singles are not 59, they're 44. Duo is not 79, it's 49. And if you buy more than one Lumi's, you get 10% off your whole Lumi's order. Like that's pretty good, right? I was really excited about that, I have to say. Um, and can I just say thank you? Because had you not responded to Lumi's when we debuted them, they would not have come to us and said, hey, like we have a special opportunity, kind of a closeout for us, great quality lantern. Clearly your customers are enjoying it. Would you like to be able to offer it to your customers? Like, I kind of feel like we've arrived. <laughs> Companies are thinking about us as a way to, um, you know, like when they have special opportunities, that they want to share them with our customers. I love that. That means you. They share them with you. So, um, all right, we're going to turn the lights out. Um, are the batteries replaceable? Yes, Lauren, they just use two double A's. So um, you get two double A's with the lantern, um, and then you just use regular double A batteries. So um, 
Yes, AA batteries. You get the remote control. The remote control is how you turn it on and off. It's easy to put together. Um, it comes shipped flat. Again, you pop it open. You've probably put together those paper lanterns before. Same kind of idea. The bulb shape or small curve goes on the outside of the lantern. The long metal piece goes on the inside. All right. And then I'm going to go turn these lights off. Let's look at the glow one more time. Ready? Oh, so good. This one didn't want to play. Let's turn this one off. There we go. Don't they look good, everybody? Oh, gosh, I love them. They're so pretty. They look good. Here's these. Look at all the patterns. Make sure when you hang them outside, like hang them at different heights, right? Like that's, that's what makes them look so cool. Here's this elongated one. You can see that. Oh, this one didn't want to turn on. What's the motto? Don't be shy. There it is. All right. So those are the Lumi's lanterns. They're all pretty great. And I have to tell you, when these are gone, they're gone. Like I said, um, this is a special offer from Lumi's. Um, these were their originals. The very first Lumi's they did were solar. Um, and then, can you turn the light back on, maybe? The first Lumi's that they did were solar. Then they moved over into the batteries. And when they did the batteries at first, they did them with the dark top. And then the next generation of that was the dyed to match. And so again, if you're just joining us, what we were able to do is work with the Lumi's company. Um, and this is still all the same qualities of the, uh, of the new generation with the exception of this top is black. The other um, one that you might've purchased in March or have seen is just dyed to match. But because they've phased out this version, we were able to get kind of their last quantities of these lanterns and offer them to you at an unbelievable value. So um, if you think you'd like them, I hope you'll check them out. Again, they're made of Tyvek. You can do your research on that material, but what I can tell you is anytime you see a house, after it's been framed, they're putting in the insulation and then it's wrapped on the outside before siding and things are put on, you'll usually see it wrapped in Tyvek. That is a brand name for this weather resistant material. It is wind resistant, it is UV resistant, it is water resistant. It's the layer of protection of your house around the wood and the framing. So think about how durable that has to be. And that's what this has been made out of. And they've done it in these amazing colors. Um, and you know, they've created just, you know, out of something so industrial, something so beautiful. All right. Good. I'm so glad you guys like them. All right. Any questions about anything we talked about tonight? I feel like we went through a lot. Again, my apologies that we were running a little late today. It was kind of one of those days. Um, any questions about the new blown glass piece? Oh, Mary, could you show the green and the petrol? All right. So green is um, the dark, no, for the lanterns. Um, and the petrol is that navy blue that I think. I think they just want to see color. Okay. So I think the blue petrol is the one outside, the round. Okay. Can you grab that? And then we'll bring in the green for you, Mary, um, so you can see. This is the dark green. Can you see? It's like a true hunter green. Let me see where that other, we had them all out here, and now it's kind of craziness. Um... Where did that green go? Oh, here, I'll show it to you on this one, Mary. Here's the green, Mary. So that's what the green looks like. Let me turn it off so you can see that better. Okay, that's the green. So it's a true like hunter green color. And then this is the petrol. Which is kind of like a pretty um, bluish, gray. Can you see it out here? Can you see the difference there? So this is the petrol, which is more of the blue, and then that's our green. I think you can see that pretty well there. Let me turn on one more light. Just Does that show it a little better, Mary? Kylie's going to show one more just in case. All right. So petrol, green, okay? 
All right, any other questions about anything, anybody? Did you like everything? There's some big news for next week. Um, Donna got the juice shampoo and conditioner last week. My husband said his hair was squeaky clean and he has oily hair. Amazing. Love that, Donna. So glad he liked it, right? Um, if it passed our test, that's one thing. If it passed the hubs test, that's another. Um, all right, let's see. What's the battery life? Is there a timer? Thank you. I have no idea what the battery life is, Lisa, but again, yes, there is a timer. It's all controlled from your remote. One, two, three, or four hours. Um, and you can decide that. You can turn it on and just leave it on for however long you want, or you can turn it on and hit one of the timer buttons, um, and it will turn off after that amount of time. Two AA batteries is all you need. Um, would they hang from a curtain rod? They could hang from a curtain rod, but here's the thing. Curtain rods are usually pretty close up against your window. So again, like half of the lantern is going to be like kind of up against the wall. Do you know what I mean? Now, if you wanted to hang them with like a fishing line from the drapery rod in front of your window, you could maybe do that. Um, but again, yeah, you could, I mean, you could slide it over. Um, but again, like, I think you would want to use some kind of a, line so that you'd have different lengths on them. I think they would look weird if you just had them up against a drapery rod at the same height as the window and the curtains. I think they need to drop down lower in front of your window. Just my opinion, you do whatever you want. Um, I have the Paisley Oval Lantern in my bedroom, love it. Great, Amanda. It sounds like you are loving these, Amanda. I'm so glad and thanks for sharing all your comments. Um, I love that. Um, what do you clean them with? Um, you know, just I would take a damp microfiber cloth. Like, let's say they'll get some bird droppings on them or something like that. Whatever, they're in a tree. Um, yeah, I mean, I would just take a damp cloth and wash them off. You'll be fine. Um, again, they I wouldn't use any harsh chemicals on these. I don't think you need them. Um, again, if they get pollen on them, again, maybe mist it with a little bit, you know, on a light mist from your garden hose. And then just wipe them off with a microfiber cloth. Pretty easy. Um, all right, anything else? Any other questions? So remember our special offers. Presentation is impressive, thank you. Well, thank you, Scott. I've done this a few times. Um, all right, so remember, offers to remember. Obviously with Lumi's, when these are gone, they're gone. This batch will go back to offering what we offered back in March, but the price on those are gonna go back up. Like those prices are what they are. So if you wanna try them, if you wanna see if they're worth it, if you want to put them to the test this summer, get this special offer while we have it. Um, and remember, if you buy more than one, you'll get 10% off the entire Lumi's order. So they're on sale. They're $15 to $30 off what the first version was. And you can get an additional 10% off if you buy more than one set. I think that's a pretty sweet deal. Um, check out our new Epiphany Studio, those beautiful blown glass pieces from Pontiac, Michigan, made right here in the USA. Um, again, really, really love that we're able to carry that kind of craftsmanship and artistry um, from you know um, American craftsmen. So I love that. Um, be sure to check out our home fragrances. Through the month of April, you'll get a bonus two ounce room spray. That's 400 spritzes, pure essential oils um, as a bonus gift and thank you with any of our home fragrance duos. That's two candles, two full size room sprays or a room spray and a candle. We have the brand new throws, great price point on those. Those would normally be 44. They're on sale for 39, so less than $40. Great presentation, great like throw for your sofa, for baskets, um, just to drape over the foot of your bed. If you like to cuddle up with a, a book, you know, in the afternoon when the air conditioning's a little chilly, um, they're great. Like you can never have too many throws, right? I can tell you, we have a huge sectional sofa in our family room. And when Doug and I remodeled that room and put that sectional in, the whole idea was when all four of us, me, Doug, Kylie, Trevor, were all sprawled out to watch a movie, we wanted room for all four of us thinking ahead to when they were adults too. And I can tell you when we're all like crashed out on that couch, every single one of us has a throw. So you can never have too many. Um, so check out those throws, check out those pretty flower dishes that we showed you. And then for those of you that stuck around, thank you. And 
please be here next Tuesday. All I can say is keep your eye out on my social media at Just Jill Bauer, wherever you're watching us now, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Keep an eye out on my social media because I am going to be making a very special announcement about a very special guest whose product we are going to start carrying here at Just Jill. And it's like one of the biggest coups in the universe, as far as I'm concerned. One of the nicest people, um, a wonderful, um, like just artistic and heartfelt and happy product. And I can't wait. So that will be next Tuesday. Stay tuned. We have to sign some paperwork and then I can announce it. <laughs> Those darn lawyers always get in the way. <laughs> Not really. Um, but anyway, so stay tuned to social media. Um, we will be announcing soon who will be joining me next Tuesday as we have another brand new product line that we will be launching here at Just Show. It's going to be pretty cool. Like major cool. Oh, and then the following week, um, another launch from a brand new collection of jewelry um, that has been a player in the jewelry world for decades. And they're coming to Just Jill too. So pretty cool. Just saying. We're going to end up, I know, such a tease, Jane, aren't I bad? Um, we are going to end April with a bang. And by the way, speaking of jewelry, please, oh my gosh, Jeanette, like it's going to be awesome. Um, please join me on Thursday at QVC because all day QVC Thursday is their Diamond and Diamondique jewelry event. And we're going to have our first ever hour of diamond, sterling silver, and 14 karat gold jewelry from Jay. Um, we have some pieces in there that, like you would have thought they were from Neiman Marcus underneath a locked case from John Hardy. Like they're so beautifully done. They have our special J touches um, and I'm thrilled with the assortment. And as an April baby, whose birthstone happens to be diamonds, they are worth investing in. So um, whether you window shop or you really shop, um, 1 p.m. Eastern time, I'll be with Mary Beth Rowe for a full hour. And then I'll be with Courtney Kandabi um, later in the evening um, in the 8 to 10 show with some pieces too. So um, busy week for me, busy week for all of you. Stay tuned for the announcements. And um, thank you so much for being here. Brenda, thank you. See you next Tuesday. Thank you, everybody. Enjoy your purchases. Send me pictures of your Lumi's lanterns out in your garden. I can't wait for you to get these at home. And um, I will see you soon. All right. Have a good night, everybody. Thanks for being here. See ya.